Welcome to Laramie, Wyoming, and one of the highest elevations you will find in all of college football. And it is home to the Wyoming Cowboys, and they have a taste for the spicy brown mustard. Little gets the blood boiling, quite like a rivalry game. Barbs, shots, trash talk, things that go on throughout the week will now all be settled on this field. He'll call for the fair catch here. So the Wyoming Cowboys offense will get the first swing of the game. There are always butterflies to start a game, but when you have a rivalry like this, the adrenaline is pumping on overdrive, guys. They aren't all the same. We say that, but we know differently. The blood is boiling, the temperature is hot. Jesse, you want this week more than most. Yeah, Dave, we played in these games before. Everything just seems to be heightened, right? The game seems to be moving faster, the crowd noise. And it's intercepted! A turnover for the defense. No real chance on the return, but they've got it at the 34. This is a team that believes they're way better than what their record indicates. I know they've got a losing record coming into this one, but they felt like they could make some plays early in this one. He's gonna pass. Hit hard as he released the ball on that first down pass and it never had a chance. Still at their own 20 after that last incompletion, it's second and 10. Hand off to the lone back. He's knocked down in the backfield, he'll lose a couple. I'll be honest, that is a formation and a play call I was never expecting to see in this game. This offense is one of the top 10 passing units in the entire country. I'm surprised they even have goal line in their playbook. What are we doing? When these wide receivers work the middle of the field, so much of this is feel. Understanding where the holes are in the zone or understanding how to get leverage on a man. And these wide receivers are dangerous nowadays because they do it so fast and see that so quick and make those plays over the middle. The Cowboys come to the line with a fresh set of downs. He puts a lot of air under it down the sideline. And it's knocked away downfield. The DB getting a hand in there. Second and ten after the previous play. Anderson will throw. Not able to hook up there, incomplete. We anticipate this one being much tighter than the last time these two met when it was a blowout, David. And here's the thing. you got an opportunity right now. you got the football early in this game to show you. This is going to be more of the same, Paul. Well, we talked to both coaching staffs and players, and they're all very aware of what happened the last time these two teams played. So expect everybody's A game today. Reese, you're right. We expect this one to be a lot tight. Just flying from the air like a superhero to make the grab. And the Cowboys are marching down the field. Looking to throw it again. They were willing to spin that wheel of fortune in their own territory, and it paid off. And it came up good. <laughs> I mean, I think you see the aggressiveness by these offenses now, willing to go for it on their own territory, and I like it because they got it. Using the quick game. He's run out of bounds, but a big play on that one, and it'll be a first down. A new set of downs after the completion. Running back searching for a hole. Ripping off a good chunk inside the 25, and they're set up with a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. Wants to throw on first down. Got his man down the middle. The tackle is made, but he's got it first and goal from the six. Defense is backed up. Shadow of the goalpost trying to defend their own end zone. Snags it. He's down at the one, and they almost had the touchdown pass on that one. Defense trying to come up with a stop on second and goal. Feeling some heat. Took a shot as he threw. That pass is incomplete, and they might be fortunate. It wasn't knocked free for a fumble. It'll be third down. From the gun, wants to pass. Makes the grab. He gets it in. Touch. Wasting no time throwing on this drive. Fires to the big fella. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. 
Anderson wants to throw. Gets it out quickly. Ever since they invented the forward pass, the tight ends have been running the drag and getting the first down. I think it's because the tight ends have so much versatility. You know, they can block and stay in the formation, or they can release and come out. But either way, if the quarterback's patient, most of the time, that drag route's going to come up. And that pass will be jarred loose on second down. That brings up third down. Trying to pick up a first down. Fires to the wide out. Got it! Gets out of bounds after the big play, and they'll be set up in business for the first and goal. Defense going all in to stop the run. Off play action on first down. And the quarterback caught up to and sacked at the 12. I love the awareness by the defense here. Everyone thinking first down, down close to the goal line, the offense is going to run the football, right? But this defense was ready for the chance that the offense might throw it. So defenders playing the pass, getting up field, getting to the QB. Awesome job. Third and goal coming up here. From the gun, wants to pass. Got his man in the middle. And after the tackle, we are headed to the end of the first quarter. Guys, we have Wyoming on top as we reach the end of the quarter. We've played one before we move on. Let's have a look at the stats. They'll try to start the second quarter by putting points on the board with a field goal. From the right hash, and this distance makes that angle not quite so severe. Trying to start the drive with a pass. And that incomplete pass caused by the big hit on first down, second down coming. They'll try to get on the same page this time, second and 10 from the 31. They go to the draw. Drag down after a pickup of five out to the 35. The Cowboys racing to the line in the hurry up. Off the play fake. They're working that left side. Good job running that route to get past the sticks because he got nothing after the catch. This is a great way to control tempo, control the game, feeding the tight end, and they've done it beautifully here in the first half. You find great matchups, Reese. I mean, you think about it. He's too good to be covered by linebackers. You like your matchup versus a safety, so zone or man, whatever you want to do, I'm going to find the big fella because he's going to be open most of the time. Breaks a tackle, and he's got room. And they get him out of bounds after an explosive run, just chewing up yardage along the way. I know it's early in the game, but defensively after that play, you know you have to tackle the catch. When this guy gets the ball in his hands, he is so dangerous after the fact. So it's OK for him to make catches. You just got to get him to the ground quickly. Operating in the red zone here on second down. Anderson will throw. It falls incomplete. He was trying to find his man for six. I love the coverage on defense. In the red zone, everyone's got their eyes on the quarterback, and they're flying to the football, and you saw that there on the incompletion. He caught it. Couldn't quite nudge it in. Not sure you could get much closer, but it'll be first and goal. The offense threatening. Close to the end zone now with a new set of downs. With jet sweep pass. Touchdown, Wyoming! And they'll put that scoreboard operator to work and put six. Okay, ready? Clear, clear. Fast motion from the offense. Off the play fake on first down, wants to throw. And the timing just a hair off. Sometimes a quarterback just needs to turn the ball loose. It was like he tried to guide that one in, and it disrupted the timing. Yeah, and, and just like in basketball, when, when you shoot a shot and you start trying to aim it, you really, really miss. You know, quarterbacks, they got to quickly recognize, do I need to fire it? Do I, do I need to put a little air underneath it? And, and it's just a tough thing for a quarterback to be able to do. But over time, you see they have less and less mishaps like that. 
the defense has their hands full trying to stop this guy in the slot. They're going to have to figure something out to bracket him, try and get two bodies around him, maybe get some safety help as well, because right now they... Touchdown, Wyoming! And they made it to the... They'll crank up this drive with the pass. Just gets rid of it to the running back underneath. They make the stop, trying to pick up just a little bit at a time to get to that first down marker. Now after the short completion, it's second down. He'll loft one deep down the left side. And it slips through his fingers incomplete. That would have been a huge gain if he could have squeezed it. Anderson wants to throw. Fires into traffic. It's picked off. Looking to move it through the air. A beautifully placed ball to the outside and the toe drag for the big pickup. They couldn't draw up a better way to start a drive and now they've got it first and 10 from the 41. Fires one high and deep. And the DB right with him to knock it away. And the incompletion brings up a second down for this offense. He's looking to throw. Got him downfield. Lots of green grass as he gets it to the 31. And the Cowboys getting set on first and 10. He's looking to throw it. Moving, keeping the eyes downfield. And he got smacked just as he released the pass. It's incomplete. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. On second down, just keeps firing. Catch in the middle. It's Hobbs. And they finally haul him down, but not before the good catch and run. The Cowboys moving quickly to the line. Look, he'll take a shot. He was open, he had it, and he dropped it. Would have been a touchdown. Instead, it's second down. The incompletion brings up a second down. Throws to the wideout. And that's going to be incomplete. A lot of contact on the play, but no flags. It'll be third down. If they can convert here, that type of play can really give you a shot of momentum. Skips away from pressure. Couldn't find anywhere to throw the football. Just got rid of it. And that's the number one thing. Avoid disaster here. So they are denied a touchdown on this drive, but they'll try to put up a three spot before the break. It is perfect. And that... Ready, fight. Set. From his end zone, trying to loosen up this D. Oh, he drops the football. He had him right down the gut of the field. Instead, it'll be second down. Yeah, and you can tell he was trying to run with that football before he caught it. That slant route, and you stick your foot in the ground, put that towards the QB. This is one of those plays where he puts it on the money, and you just try to make yards after the catch, but key word being after the catch. And would they dare be aggressive on third down this deep in their own territory? The offense showing motion from the tight end, trying to get a read on the D. They'll run it out of the shotgun. And he's not going to make it. The defense denying him the first down. And the Cowboys will bring the punt team onto the field. Sometimes avoiding disaster is the best thing. The punter just gets it out of there. Not able. He wastes no time and comes out throwing. Oh, he had it right down the middle, and he just squirted right through his fingers, and they miss an opportunity for a nice play on first down. Quickly complete. They stop him almost immediately. Short gain there, and still a little ground to cover to pick up the first. This offense looking at a third down after that last completion. Anderson will throw. 
got the back over the middle. And the completion gives him a fresh set of downs and keeps his drive moving. Now on first down from the 28 for the offense. On third down, offenses have their plays. What they like in third and short, what they like third and medium, third and long. Great job by the offense having success. Now, it's incumbent upon the defense to learn their plays and try to shut it down throughout the game. After misfiring, it's second down. The aerial assault continues. Quick strike complete. Well, they made the grab, but the doors closed quickly after that. And I like this. I want to find my running back, but man, he's got to do a little more damage after the catch. I need, a, I need a stiff arm. I need a spin move. I need something where he can make that guy miss and can pick up a bunch of yards and maybe get a big play out of it. The Cowboys send out the punt unit. Yeah, and I like the shot, the aggressive play down the field. And we like throwing those jump balls up to my receiver because usually the receiver makes the play. And... Motion from the offense. Little touch pass to the receiver. A seven-yard pickup. It'll be second and three. He tried to pound it on first down. Now back to the line. Off play action. Fires to the big fella. He makes the tackle at the 33 after a pickup of five. As they get set to snap it, just about to reach the end of the quarter. To the air on first down. Quick completion on the out route. And they'll move the change with the first down. That might be it for the third quarter. Well, offensively, they knew they were going to have some matchups they could take advantage of in this one. And all of a sudden, this quarterback has now over 300 yards passing in the game. Defensively, David, he has got them on their heels. And he's been showing you a little bit of everything. He can throw it all over the field to all different receivers, to his tight ends, to his running backs. Really has the ability to spread it around. And now over 300 yards. Still some time left. And he can put up even bigger numbers. And heck, go chase some awards, man. Get some postseason awards. Get an All-American. Just put up a day. Right back to the well. That's what you expect from a senior. Don't give them any extra yards. Great tackle there. After picking up a couple at second and eight. He lost one down the sideline. And they wanted it all on that incomplete pass. Instead, they're looking at third down. They line up with some serious work to do if they want to convert this one. On third down, he drops to throw. And the sophomore just a little too much on that one. And the Cowboys will try to pin them back with the punt. It's so nice when you know it's third and long, you know a pass is coming. They'll run it, trying to drain time off the clock. That's got to be demoralizing if you're the defense. You're trailing. You need to get the ball back. you got to get off the field, but you can't stop the run when they're going between the tackles. This defense is going to have to get a lot more physical, especially in the middle. Makes the grab down the middle. And he's brought to the ground, but not before he gets it up for the first down. And now a fresh set of downs for this offense. And it's incomplete. If you're going to take a hit like that, you might as well hang on to the ball. After they couldn't connect, it's second and ten. I'm a little bit surprised they're still throwing the football here this late in the game with this kind of lead. They're on first down, taking a shot, falls incomplete. But obviously, they're still seeing matchups they want to take advantage of in the back end of this defense, so they're letting it fly. Here comes third and short from the 27. This defense trying to make them settle for a field goal. Quick pass on the fly motion. Wrestled to the ground after picking up the first down. First down here with time for maybe one more play until the two-minute warning. Anderson wants to throw. He's got it down the middle. Makes the catch, and he's brought down. We reached the two-minute warning, and this offense is that much closer to salting away a victory. Dialing up a second down pass play. And he really needed to hold on to that one, but it was not loose, and third down is coming. Boy, they'd love to move the sticks here and take a shot at it on first and goal. Blair, Blair, Yankee Blue! Yankee Blue! 
in the gun and looking to throw on third down. And it's incomplete despite some serious arm strength shown there. And this kicker has had a busy night. The field goal unit is out there for the third time. They're going to throw it to start the drive. The quick out. At the 35, he's got room. And he'll go out of bounds, and this aerial attack just continues to carve this defense into tiny slices. Use the play fake. Now to throw. Unleashes to the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboys. And the pummeling has started. They put another score on the board as they try to push this winning streak. And I don't think they got it snapped before the play clock ran out. Delay of game, game, game. Offense. offense. Offense took a little bit too much time at the line there. Out of the shotgun, they go to the ground. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. So let's see if they can make up for that loss on second down from the 18. Looking for room, it's Scott. And they'll stop him after a minimal pickup. You make up the game plan and not a lot on the play sheet for this. Third and long from inside their own 20. Anderson will throw. He lobs one high down the left side. One last incompletion and that'll do it. So after stumbling around a bit earlier this season, they put together three consecutive wins and seem to have righted the ship. Dang right. How do you how do you handle adversity? Every coach talks about that. They dealt with it now. They, they got the loss. They had a little bit of struggle early in the season. What do you do? You respond by putting a winning streak together, gaining some momentum as the season closes. And sometimes the good thing about losing games early is that you know you're not perfect. You have to come out.